From the smartphones we hold to the medical devices implanted within us, technology has already begun to augment our lives. These advancements offer us a glimpse into a future where the lines between human and machine blur, a future ripe with both promise and uncertainty. Join me today as we embark on a journey into the next frontier human augmentation in 2024. Think about it. How often do you rely on your smartphone? It's practically an extension of ourselves, granting instant access to information, communication, and entertainment. We wear fitness trackers that monitor our every step and heart rate, providing valuable insights into our health. Get ready to explore a world where limitations are challenged and possibilities seem boundless. Human augmentation, in its essence, is the use of technology to enhance our physical, cognitive, and sensory abilities beyond our natural limits. Imagine a world where disabilities are a thing of the past, where our minds can directly interface with machines, and our senses are heightened beyond our wildest dreams. This transformative technology has the potential to reshape our world in ways we can only begin to fathom. Are we ready for a future where technology becomes an intrinsic part of our identity? How will these advancements impact our social structures, our economy, and even our very sense of self? For centuries, prosthetics have served as a means to restore lost function, providing artificial limbs for amputees. But we're on the cusp of a revolution in prosthetic technology, one that promises not just to restore, but to enhance human capability. Imagine prosthetics controlled by thought, seamlessly integrated with the nervous system, offering strength and dexterity that surpasses natural limbs. Today, researchers are developing bionic limbs with advanced sensors and actuators capable of mimicking the intricate movements of a human hand. Athletes with prosthetic limbs are now competing at the highest levels, shattering records and redefining the limits of human potential. This fusion of technology and art is blurring the lines between disability and ability, challenging our very notions of what's normal. Perhaps the most awe-inspiring and potentially transformative area of human augmentation lies in the realm of brain-computer interfaces or BCIs. Imagine a world where our thoughts can directly control external devices, allowing us to interact with computers, machines, and even other minds without the need for physical movement or speech. BCIs work by decoding the electrical signals generated by our brains and translating them into commands that can be understood by machines. Through implanted electrodes, paralyzed patients can now control robotic arms, move cursors on a computer screen, and even communicate their thoughts. Imagine a future where we can download information directly into our brains, learning new skills and languages in an instant. While prosthetics and BCIs focus on augmenting our physical and cognitive abilities externally, genetic enhancements delve into the very fabric of our being, offering the potential to modify our DNA to enhance desired traits and eliminate genetic diseases. This is the realm of CRISPR technology, a revolutionary gene editing tool that allows scientists to make precise changes to our genetic code, on the one hand, it holds the promise of eradicating devastating genetic diseases like cystic fibrosis and Huntington's disease before a child is even born. However, the ability to alter the human germline, meaning changes would be passed down to future generations, raises ethical dilemmas that society must grapple with. Will genetic enhancements exacerbate existing social inequalities, creating a divide between the genetically enhanced and the unenhanced? As we venture further into the uncharted territory of human augmentation, it becomes increasingly crucial to address the ethical and societal implications of these transformative technologies. One of the most pressing ethical concerns is the potential for widening existing social divides. Will access to these technologies be limited to the wealthy and privileged, creating a new class of enhanced individuals? As we explore the potential of human augmentation, we inevitably stumble upon a question that has captivated philosophers and scientists for centuries. What does it truly mean to be human? Imagine a world where individuals can enhance their cognitive abilities, process information at lightning speed, and access vast stores of knowledge with a mere thought. How do we define human rights in an era of augmented individuals? While the potential benefits of human augmentation are vast, we cannot ignore the potential risks particularly the risk of exacerbating existing social and economic inequalities. Access to these transformative technologies will likely be unevenly distributed, at least initially, potentially creating a new divide between the augmented and the unenhanced. Imagine a world where the wealthy can afford to enhance their cognitive abilities, giving their children a significant advantage in education and employment. We must strive to ensure that these technologies are accessible to all regardless of their socioeconomic status. 
the rise of human augmentation will undoubtedly have a profound impact on the future of work. As machines become increasingly sophisticated, capable of performing tasks once thought to be the exclusive domain of humans, the job market will undergo a significant transformation. Some jobs will become obsolete while others, yet to be imagined, will emerge. Imagine a world where augmented workers equipped with enhanced strength, precision and endurance collaborate seamlessly with robots in factories and construction sites. This shift in the workforce will require individuals to adapt and acquire new skills. We must invest in education and training programs that equip individuals with the skills they need to thrive in an augmented world. As with any transformative technology, human augmentation raises complex ethical and societal questions that demand careful consideration and regulation. Striking a balance between fostering innovation and mitigating potential risks is crucial. We need to establish clear guidelines and regulatory frameworks that govern the development and deployment of these technologies. How do we ensure that these technologies are used responsibly and ethically? How do we prevent the creation of a two-tiered society divided between the augmented and the unenhanced? Open and transparent dialogue is essential to ensure that these technologies are developed and used in a manner that benefits all of humanity. The year 2024 promises to be a pivotal one for the field of human augmentation. While advancements in prosthetics, gene editing, and other areas continue at a rapid pace, one promising technology involving brain-computer interfaces has captured the world's attention is Neuralink, a startup company spearheaded by Elon Musk. Has the potential to revolutionize our relationship with technology, blurring the lines between human and machine in unprecedented ways. Imagine a world where individuals with paralysis can control prosthetic limbs with the power of thought, where the blind can see through artificial eyes connected directly to their brains. Human trials are expected to begin soon, raising both excitement and ethical concerns about the future of this transformative technology. At the heart of Neuralink's technology lies a tiny, implantable chip that contains thousands of microscopic electrodes. These electrodes are designed to be inserted into the brain with incredible precision, allowing them to record and stimulate the activity of individual neurons. The potential applications of this technology are vast and varied. In the realm of medicine, Neuralink could be used to treat a wide range of neurological disorders, including Parkinson's disease, epilepsy, and Alzheimer's disease. Beyond medical applications, Neuralink has the potential to enhance human capabilities in unprecedented ways. Imagine a world where we can download information directly into our brains, learning new skills and languages in an instant. While the medical applications of Neuralink are undoubtedly exciting, the wider implications of this technology are what truly capture the imagination. Imagine a world where we can communicate telepathically, sharing our thoughts and emotions directly with others. However, with such transformative power comes a profound responsibility. As we delve deeper into the uncharted territory of brain-computer interfaces, we must proceed with caution, carefully considering the ethical and societal implications of merging our minds with machines. The year 2024 marks a turning point in human history, a year when the seemingly impossible edges closer to reality. Neuralink, with its promise of merging minds and machines, represents a giant leap forward in the field of human augmentation, opening up a world of possibilities and challenges. As we stand on the dawn of this new era, it is essential that we embrace the future with open minds, carefully considering both the potential benefits and risks of these transformative technologies. We must engage in open and honest dialogue involving scientists, ethicists, policymakers, and the public to ensure that these advancements are used responsibly and ethically. By embracing innovation while upholding our shared values, we can harness the power of these technologies to create a better future for all of humanity. Reflecting on the augmentation revolution. As we conclude our exploration of human augmentation, it's striking to realize how rapidly the landscape is evolving. From rudimentary prosthetics to brain-computer interfaces, our abilities have reached unprecedented heights. This journey is a profound reflection on our values and our understanding of what it means to be human. Innovations once considered futuristic are now woven into our lives. Human augmentation is poised to reshape our reality. The ethical considerations are profound and demand careful scrutiny. The future of human augmentation is not predetermined. It's a narrative we write daily, shaped by today's choices, ethical guidelines, and societal values. This journey involves everyone, demanding collective wisdom. 
Imagine access to augmentations as a right, empowering individuals with disabilities not creating new divides, using augmentation to address global challenges. Strive for a future where human potential is amplified by ingenuity and compassion. The path forward requires open dialogue and critical thinking. Question assumptions, challenge the status quo, and pursue a just future for all. As we venture further into the uncharted territory of human augmentation, the power to enhance our abilities is a double-edged sword, capable of both great good and potential harm. It's imperative that we proceed with a deep sense of responsibility, guided by a robust ethical framework that safeguards human dignity, promotes equity, and ensures that these technologies are used for the betterment of humanity as a whole. One of the most pressing ethical dilemmas we face is the potential for widening existing social divides. If access to these transformative technologies is limited to the wealthy and privileged, we risk creating a two-tiered society where the enhanced have a significant advantage over the unenhanced. This could exacerbate existing inequalities in healthcare, education, and employment, leading to social unrest and instability. To mitigate this risk, we must prioritize equitable access to human augmentation technologies, ensuring that they are available to all, regardless of their socioeconomic status. This requires a multi-pronged approach, including government subsidies, philanthropic funding, and innovative business models that make these technologies more affordable and accessible. The future of human augmentation is a tapestry woven from innovation, ethics, and choices. It's a future full of unknowns, both exciting and daunting. The human spirit will continue to push the boundaries of what's possible. Imagine a world where disabilities are opportunities for ingenuity. Picture a future where our minds interact seamlessly with the digital realm. Envision a society where technology respects human dignity and autonomy. This is the future we must dare to dream of, a catalyst for positive change. Technology empowers us to create a just, equitable, and sustainable world. Let us embrace the unknown with courage and compassion. The landscape of human enhancement is constantly evolving, presenting us with unprecedented opportunities and complex ethical dilemmas. Now it's your turn to join the conversation. What are your thoughts on the potential benefits and risks of human augmentation? How do you envision these technologies shaping our future? Share your insights, questions, and concerns in the comments section below. Let's engage in a respectful and thought-provoking dialogue as we navigate this uncharted territory together. Thank you for watching Time Pilgrimage, and as always please remember to subscribe and like. If there is a topic that you would like to explore, please drop a comment. Let's continue to explore the past, understand the present, and envision the future together.